Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai. Give double honors to the apostles and elders of the great millstone, who were well. Peace, love, salutations to the elect 144. And uh, I was just, you know, just scrolling through RT News and found and stumbled upon this. This came out today about four hours ago. Uh, and it, it reads the petrol dollar in, in looming as China and allies dump it. And oil trading, and as you know, um, you know, uh, I think earlier last year or this year, Russia became the number one leading country in oil production, and you know they're allied with China, they're allied with South Africa, they're allied with Iran, if I'm not mistaken. So when it says China and allies, it's speaking about Russia, that's speaking about Iran, that's speaking about South Africa, speaking about other countries that are not allied with America, okay. And, um, and speaking about Venezuela, because Venezuela just today um, dropped the U.S. dollar. So we'll see how the events turn out for that for that country. And China is doing the same thing. All right. And it reads, Beijing is announced, has announced plans to start a crude oil fu uh, futures contract priced in yuan and convertible into gold because their money is backed up by gold unlike the united states the united states money is worth nothing they have nothing backing it the step might lead to the emergence of a new asia based crude oil benchmark to compete with brent or west texas intermediate futures so that's a big step because most crude oil trading and whatnot or um are uh, controlled by the U.S. dollar, okay? And you continue reading. RT talked to investigating guru and financial commentator Jim Rogers to understand how much of a game changer this could be for an industry dominated by the dollar, the oil industry. And, and he said, um, this is just another step in that direction. Many people do not like using U.S. dollars because if the U.S. gets angry at you, they just set enormous pressure on you that can give that can even get you out of business. China, Russia and other countries understand this and they <clears throat> are trying to move world trade and world finance away from that, said Jim Rogers. So they're trying to get away from um, using the dollar, the other countries. Now, China owns most of the United States debt. So them dropping that would would significantly significantly hurt the US dollar even though it's already demolished in the first place it would be like the icing on the cake or the cherry on top of the cake or whatever you want to call it and then it's going to have an aftermath in the United States so let me go ahead and back it by scriptures All right, I'm just gonna get some, some a classic scripture to start off with. Um, all right, this is um, Ecclesi Ecclesiastes. I'm gonna go jump right down to four, and the door shall be shut in the streets. The door shall be shut in the streets when the sounding of the grinding is is low. Okay, that grinding is work. Okay, because once China finally uh, finalizes all of that, the petrodollar dropping it, America's done for. America's done for financially, economically. Everybody's losing jobs. All right, and more than likely, it could it could cause war. And he shall rise up at the voice of the bird, and all the daughters of the music shall be brought low. But the the point is in the beginning of that of that scripture, the petrodollar drops. America's done for. Okay, no more work, no more nothing. Okay, this is Revelation 18. Okay, this goes more into the destruction of Babylon, but it can be synonymous to what's going on right here as well. And I'm going to start at verse 9, and I'm going to read down. And the kings on the earth who have committed fornication and lived deliciously with her, China, Russia, Iran, um, Germany, all those type of countries, 
uh, shall bewail her and lament for her when they see when they shall see the smoke of her burning that ultimately is going into the destruction of Babylon or of America when they see it burning as a memorial after the nuclear destruction missiles come yes the nuclear missiles for those idiots who believe otherwise okay verse 10 standing afar off um, for the fear of her torment saying alas alas the great city Babylon that mighty city for in one hour is thy judgment come okay and if you do any research on it once the economy collapses it's not going to take four or five months two years for everything to go to shit it's going to take about 12 hours people are going to be running to the food stores or the, the grocery stores people are going to be looting everything in the nine yards you saw it with hurricane irma and hurricane harvey so what's so more an economic collapse okay um verse 11 and the merchants of the earth shall weep and mourn over her for no man buyeth their merchandise anymore china is done with it china's dropping it uh venezuela has already dropped it if i'm not mistaken one of those countries in the middle east have dropped it they're done with american dollars okay and they're not using the dollar anymore technically as a merchandise okay merchandise of gold and silver and precious stones and of pearls and fine linen and purple and silk and scarlet and all thine uh and all thine wood um and all manner of vessels of ivory and all manner of vessels of precious wood and of brass and iron and marble and cinnamon and odors and on, um, ointments and frankincense and wine and oil and fine flour and wheat and beast and sheep and horses and chariots and slaves and souls of men and souls of men they don't need america anymore they're dropping it okay and the fruits that they thy soul lusted after are departed from thee and all these and all things which are dainty and good goodly are departed from thee and thou shalt find them no more at all the merchants of these things which were made rich by her so the merchants of these things which were made rich by her china russia so on and so forth shall stand afar off for the fear of, uh, of her torment weeping and welling okay they're gonna drop them and this is all leading up to the ultimate destruction of america in the first place okay them dropping the petrol dollar is gonna cause is gonna cause martial law nobody to have work concentration camps in america which is the beginning of troubles which is the start of daniel uh, 12 and 1 and then comes the nuclear missiles and they're going to be standing afar off for the fear of her torment torment because those missiles are going to be tormenting the land okay in the people in the land all right, a lot of people are going to get slain, okay? And saying, alas, alas, that great city that has clothed, uh, that was clothed in fine linen and purple and scarlet and decked with gold, that the the, the colors purple and scarlet are, are symbolic. And decked with gold, gold is symbolic. And precious stones and, pour, and pearls. For in one hour, so great riches is come to naught. And I promise you, man, the collapse of the economic system here is, is going to be quick okay and every shipmaster and every shipmaster and all the company and, and ships and sailors and as many as trade by sea stood afar off and that's going to that's going to happen coming up soon because they're not going to want to trade with them anymore knowing that their dollar means nothing they already know it means nothing. The only reason they're doing this is because, like the article said, it puts pressure on them. America puts pressure on them to not drop the dollar. It will cause war as well. And cried when they saw the smoke of her burning, saying, What city is like unto this great city? Oh, and again, them dropping the dollar does cause war. Look at um, how they go into Syria. How they go into Afghanistan, Saddam Hussein, Gaddafi. Well, let's see what happens with Venezuela soon because they just dropped the dollar today. Okay. 
and cried when they saw the smoke of her burning when the missiles came saying what city is like unto this great city you know and they cast dust on their heads and cried weeping and welling saying alas alas that great city wherein were made rich where america used to be rich the booming 20s or whatever you call them you know um people always wanted to come over here the gold rush in california you know the oil rush down down south america used to be booming you know and people wanted to trade alas alas that great city we're in were made rich because back then america was making other countries rich until they started going in debt to those other countries all that had ships in the sea by reason of her costliness for in one hour she is made desolate so this is big time for china to be taking the steps to end the petrol dollar and using the yuan as the primary uh currency for oil trade so i just wanted to get that out real quick uh, i want to give all praises to you how about shimmy how shy Give them all honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Peace, love, salutations to the elect 144. Keep pushing, keep fighting. This economic collapse is near. The chip is already here. We're about to enter into some um, some tribulation. Okay? Be strong. Okay? Sober-minded, meaning calm in spirit. So you can see what's going on. Alright. Shalom.